call the Irishman call. Or by the Here, fifteen. Welcome to Improv Live 365. Yeah, they happen to come in with the teeth. It's just coming from some other source and through me. In a sense, I sort of came full circle. Taking time to listen deeply. This is what it is. I understand this. It's all in uh, shades of dark and light. Improvisation is a great antidote. I feel good about the future of the world. <laughs> He's the grandmother of improvisational theater. Always that tension between control and letting go, you know. It just kind of gets a life of its own. Improvising is extremely uncomfortable. But Ray Drummond was right, it's never let me down. And I'd love to see even more teachers using this free resource. I found something called a replicator melon. Making growth, you know, letting the world grow. Surrounded by the rhythms of life. Like, like being, in, being in a river and you're just kind of being carried by the current. Giving your heart in that moment every time. So don't ever touch your instrument unless you're going to play music on it. Got to be able to grab those moments when, when it comes. I love spring. Because I feel like it's honest business. There's choices there all the time that enable us to be creative. On a good day or a good night, the ego just goes away. Well, come here, listen to this. Um, it's a great story. To keep that wow happening. And you'll know if it's right, if it sounds right. Thanks for improvising with us today. We'll see you tomorrow on Improv Live 365.